I'm <laughs> I'm slightly nervous. I have to say I have no idea how the flying. Huh? Do I have to do anything, or do you do I just let you go? I think I just let you go. Oh, damn. Oh my god. What is going on, everybody? My name is Hypercore Ripper, and today we are starting Astroneer. So this game came out about a week ago. I picked it up just the other day, and I have been absolutely loving every single second of it. I was a little bit skeptical at first when I saw the initial videos of it and everything. I thought, I'm not going to enjoy that kind of game. And how wrong I was. If you are thinking about getting this game, I would seriously suggest just picking it up, giving it a go. If you don't enjoy it, you can always refund it but I think you'll enjoy it I think you will absolutely love it I am addicted to it at the moment so what we're going to do today is we are going to build up my existing base which I've been working on as you can see I've at the moment got a research center I have got a vehicle bay vehicle bay and I've got a smelter and over there we've got a 3d printer which is my latest addition and on these I've got a solar panel which the solar panel really should be in fact I'm gonna I'm gonna put you I'm going to bring you over here to my nice little space truck and I'm going to put you right there because what I've been relying on for this space truck the whole time, no, would you like to get on there, thank you, is just little uh, power cells that I've been getting everywhere. So like that one over there, I've just been sucking them up and placing them on the side here, which has been working quite well, but I think this will work a little bit better. It's a little bit more efficient. So we'll need to replace that uh, 3D printer over there with something else. I have also been moving this generator <laughs> around from each one. <laughs> Which has also been working incredibly well. And then I've also got a wind turbine. I've also got one of those on my shoulder there. Uh, what have I got in my backpack at the moment? Just got some compounds, some empty slots, and a, a two batteries. Two batteries. You can't have enough power in this game. So what I'm going to do first is we need to get a chair. We need to get a seat because today we're going to launch my little space shuttle. Is that? Yeah, it's a space shuttle. We're going to launch it. I've already got a load of hydrazine. I think, yep, hydrazine fuel. That's all fueled up and ready to go. Now we just need a seat. We could also put some storage on there, but nah, I just want a seat. I just want a seat and I want to get the show on the road. And in fact, I think we need to do that through the printer, if I am correct. Yes. So we just need two compounds. Which, wait, have I got two, oh my god, <laughs> holy shit, I was fully expecting having to go out and uh, collect some stuff, but no, <laughs> I've already got it, <laughs> that's fantastic, we're going to do that right now, I can't wait, I'm so excited about this, and that is one glorious seat created, the other one, the other seat that I've got over there on my truck, I actually found, which was great. <laughs> It's very, very useful. It was uh, it was in a wreckage over there, which I will show you guys in a bit. We're going to, in fact, before we launch, I'll take you on a, a little tour of what I've done. Easy does it. Easy does it. Easy does it. The, the driving in this is a little bit strange. I have to say the handling of the truck is very, very peculiar indeed. <laughs> so let me just take you on our tether line here. I've also got a tether going down. In fact, in fact... <laughs> New plan, I will show you the tether line going down into the cave first. Yes, that's right, I got a cave. I think this was actually the first thing that I did when I got into the game. So down here, this tether simply goes around there. I haven't expanded it out over into that area yet, but I will eventually. And can I research you? Have you got to... Oh, you have got to... And you've probably got something on you. Oh, which one shall I do? I'm going to do... I don't know, we'll choose when we come back. We'll do an eeny, meeny, miny, mo. And if I just screw... No, just... Just do that. You just kind of do that and then you are free. And this simply goes all the way down here. There's a giant bit all the... It's a huge cave, okay? This this cave, cave system that I've dug myself into is absolutely enormous. But this tether simply goes down here and stops here. And look, there is a <laughs> giant <laughs> ribcage to something. Some animal which has been here. And actually, hold on a second. Have you got something which I could re... Oh, no, just stop. What the fuck? What the hell? Where did you come from? Oh, they're dropping from the ceiling. What in the world? Oh, oh, you're... Oh, I might have to take... Should I take one of you? Are you a, a green one? You're a green one. I thought it was a white one for a second. I hadn't seen a white one before. There's an... Is there another one up there? No. Oh, that's interesting. Why did you just decide to jump down? 
Running out of oxygen. Gonna die. Can't breathe. Uh, where is it? There it is. It's up there. <gasps> okay, breathing. There, there is another thing. Maybe you guys can help me out with this. I've got... I don't know why that says tethers. That is an oxygen tank right there. It was full up, and it's only been full up once. And I cannot, for the life of me, work out how to refill it up. I've, I've stood here for like five minutes next to a tether. I've stood next to my main base. I have tried picking up oxygen, um, and I just, ow, I just cannot, I just cannot get it to refill. So if there must be something incredibly obvious that I'm doing wrong, or it's a glitch. I don't know. What is this? What is this? Hello. Hello, is there any oxygen down here? Are there any, uh, did I see some blue? Is that back up top or is it, is this it here? Ah, yes, there is, good. Right, no, no! <gasps> bad spikies! That's a bad spiky! Oh my god! I can't believe that's the first time I've died! <laughs> now, in this, ah, okay, there you go. I was told that you, your character doesn't disappear and you lose all your stuff. Apparently you can go over to your corpse... You can give him a little tickle, and he'll uh, he'll give you all of your stuff back. So why will uh, I will just maybe get, will you? Hurt? You're not really spiky, so it's just you little shits on the ground there. Can I? How do I get rid of you? Can I just? Can I pick you up? I can't pick you up. All right, let's just steer clear of them. Oh, it was that one right there. There's my body right next to the spiky. Can I just get you to dip that way? Oh no no no! Where are you going? Oh wait, can I lift you up? Yeah. Oh, take that. Yoink. Take like that. Is that all you... What? Did I not have anything else? I didn't have anything else. Do you smelt these down to make aluminium? I can't remember exactly what they are, but this... Oh, it's... Hi oh, no, that's hydrazine. That's the fuel. Okay, fine. I could take this. Actually, I'm going to take that. I, I like researching these. So, let's get back to the surface, uh, get this thing researched, and then I will take you on a little trip just to the end of my surface tether and where it ends and what's over there. And then we will come back here and we will fly. We will fly and it will be glorious. It will be absolutely beautiful. So have I already got enough power? I have already got enough power. Yeah, it's already juiced up. Okay, what are you going to give me? Is it sunrise? Or is it sunset at the moment? It's sunrise. Oh, that's nice. Cool. Well, what are you going to give me, little ball? you going to give me something good? Give me something good? You're going to give me something good? We got a habitat. Ooh. Okay, we got a habitat. That's pretty good, I suppose. Is that a good thing? <laughs> I'm assuming you create it with the uh, the 3D printer, which is currently out of power. I really need to create some more solar panels. And I think... How do you do that? I think it's with the 3D printer, and uh, I'm not sure what you need. I think it might be lithium. So over here, we have got a crashed satellite. I don't know what you can do with this thing. It looks like you should be able to do something. You can attach things onto it, but if you can relaunch it, I would be amazed because it's kind of fucked up at the moment. It's really bent and damaged, so I don't think you can really do anything with it. So we'll leave you alone for now, and then if we just keep on going a little bit further, we've got a power uh, spore there. Is that what they're called? A power spore? Power tree? I don't know. Uh, we've also got... Wait, is that another... Oh! Did I not notice you before? What in the world? Oh, you just been sitting here all on your own, you poor thing. <laughs> I could, could I have used that instead? Nah, surely not. Surely not. I, I highly doubt it. And then, here, we've got this big thing, which at uh, the moment it's got organic on it. It did have a bunch of things on it, which I stole, like titanium. And it, it had a couple of rare things on there, which was very, very useful. And the tether simply ends over there. I think that is an oxygen plant or like a, uh, a group of them. I don't know what it's called, what that formation is called. But it's a load of them that you can use to harvest and get lots and lots of sweet oxygen. So now we are going to do it. We are going to launch into space. This is the first time I've done it. So I don't know how well or how wrong this is going to go. <laughs> Hopefully it's going to go very, very well. What, what are you? Ah, oh, Titan. Wait, what? Wasn't there a second one just there? Or did I just did I just pick it up? I did just pick it up. Why did you just pick it? I don't want you to. No, you leave it right there for safekeeping. That is rare stuff. We need it for, I don't know. We need it for something. We can make a tank, another power tank. I don't know if we really need another power tank. Should I take fuel with me? I'm thinking I probably should, but we'll probably be able to harvest some once we land wherever it is we're going to land. So, I think we're good to go. Should I move this thing, or? Do, uh, are you good? Are you, you're not going to bump into anything? You promise? Alrighty. 
I'm <laughs> I'm slightly nervous. I have to say, I have no idea how the flying. Huh? Do I have to do anything, or do you? Do I just let you go? I think I just let you go. Damn. Oh my god. Did I mention how beautiful I think this game is? By the way, I don't think I did. That is so cool. So that is the planet we're currently on. Can we move around to other ones? I wonder. Or will you automatically take me to other ones? Or are you just going to take me to a different spot on our current planet? I think that's what it's going to do. I think to uh, move to another planet, we would need maybe jets on the side here. So that's fine. We will do that another time. I'm going to land. Uh, I'm going to land. I don't even know where we were before. Is there a, a marker or anything like that? I don't know. He's going to go around for a second try. <laughs> no, he's not. No, it was a lie. He's... Jeez, you're going in... <laughs> Don't go that fast. You're making me nervous. Oh. Okay. So, uh, yeah. Here we are. Wonder Wait, is there a storm? There is not about to be a storm. Please tell me there's not about to be a storm. So, it looks like there's another crash satellite over here. Have you got anything... Ow. Have you got anything I could possibly take back to my lovely little home? If I can ever actually find my home again. I... <laughs> I really hope I'm going to be able to. I'm assuming that when you fly around the planet again, there'll be a marker just saying, Your home is over here. Land, land, land. Give me all of your resin. All of your resin. Yes. Yes. There's more. Oh, there's more. There's loads more. You just got to keep on digging in this. Keep on a digging and breaking your ankles. That's always good. <laughs> I don't know how this is going to work. If it's going to detach itself when we put this down or... Hopefully you will. Nice, 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 kind of nice, I suppose. You're, you're kind of going through the ground. <laughs> You've got floating space grass above you. I don't know how that's worked out, but it kind of has. Yeah, you just, Mr. Spacecraft, you just float there. You do whatever you want. <laughs> so for this, we should only need, do we only need two for this? Or do we just need another one? Okay. I'm not sure if this is what I'm meant to be doing, but yes it is, yes it is, there we go. So now we put two down, and that is going to turn itself into one of these. I don't know what this is called, but essentially this is the uh, the platform of the station that we use to create other things. So we got a, uh, we got the 3D printer, fuel condenser, research station, smelting, vehicle bay, trade platform, printer, and sorry, printer, we've already done. <laughs> I really need to get on and research some other things. I'm very curious about the trade platform. I haven't actually tried it out yet. I would really like to know what it does. So it's going to be between that, the uh, smelter, and the vehicle bay. So I'm thinking we might go for the smelter because for the vehicle bay we need aluminium. So once we've got the aluminium ore, we would then need to smelt it down. So the smelter is absolutely the right thing to go for. Let's see. Shall we dig down? Or should we have a little run around the surface for a bit? I'm thinking of, uh, I'm thinking of digging down. Let's dig down right next to this so we've constantly got oxygen. And we don't really have to worry about that then. Down we go into the depths. Please don't let there be any monsters down here ready to gobble me up. I would really appreciate it if you didn't. Oh, damn. Oh, we are going full on Minecraft on this bitch right now. <laughs> oh, God. Okay. All right. All right. I understand what you're saying. I understand what you're saying. Can you even climb back? Oh, thank goodness. Oh, I'm so worried that I'm going to create one of these slopes sometime and I'm not going to be able to get back up. <laughs> I'm just going to smooth that bit out there. I'm a little bit OCD as well with my uh, <laughs> with my sculpting. <laughs> you will notice that. It will become very apparent. Give me your power. Yes. Yes. Thank you very much. Okay. Back down into the cave we go. I don't know how much longer we've got to uh, dig down. I'd like to think we haven't got a hell of a lot more to do. But I don't know. If, if It depends if we actually come across a cave or not. We should dig into something, I hope. Oh, it's changed colour. Is that a good sign? It might be a good sign. It might not be. It might be the worst sign ever. It might, <laughs> might be telling me, don't dig down any further. You are going to die. You are going to die. No, no, we're, no I think we're going to be okay. The thing I'm worried about at the moment actually is oxygen. Is it's gonna take? Uh, is it gonna take me long to get? No, nah, it sh shouldn't take me too long to get back up there. God damn! Are we gonna be able to actually find something? I think I might be about to hit the crust. <laughs> really? The oh, okay, right. Let's go back up there. And just get some O2. Get some good old-fashioned O2. Oh, this is deep. We have gone really deep. I might try another section actually. 
Hurry! Hurry! You're going to start. So yeah, I told you you're going to start. Okay, there we go. Oh, breathe it in. Breathe in that sweet, sweet air. Shall we go and try another place? I'm tempted to go and try another place. I might go walk along that trench there and see if there's a cave entrance along there. Have we got a storm coming? Have we? The, the screen has just gotten a little bit sort of blurred. Is that a uh, is that a bad sign? Oh, that's that is a bad sign. That's a very bad sign. Where are you? Where are you? I need to get back in you. Quick, 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 quick. Hurry, get inside the space shuttle. Okay, we are safe. We, <laughs> even though we haven't got any glass or anything covering us, we're gonna be okay. And here come the boxes. I don't know why they chose boxes, but they work as well. <laughs> Killer boxes. Bring it on. You're not gonna be able to do a thing. You're not even denting this thing. You're gonna need to try a little bit harder than that. If you want to go, ooh, that was a that was a nice spinny one there. <laughs> You're gonna have to try a little bit harder if you want to kill Hypercore Ripper, okay? Right, the storm has passed. Let us go down carefully, or not so carefully, into this trench and see if we can find anything around here. And in fact, how do we make tethers again? Tether, 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 tether. You are made with compounds. So if we could find some compounds. That would be a really... Oh, what is that up there? What are you? Oxygen! Hey, okay, that's fine. Oxygen, oxygen. There we go. I will just refill you. Don't need to complain. It's cool. What have we got here? What is this? Is this... Oh, it's just more hydrazine. Just more hydrazine. I will slowly learn the, the items in this game, guys. I promise you, I will. It will happen. But <laughs> for now, I am still learning. Is this resin? I think it's resin. Yep, we got some resin here, so... Yeah, we'll take a little bit more of that just in case we want to build anything new. And then there was another one. I saw another one. What is that over there? Hello there. What are you? What are you? You want to give me some stuff? Well, that's cool. I will take your compounds. Oh, excellent. Okay. I've never seen one of these before. I've only ever seen them in like small piles on the ground. And there's a ton of them there as well. <laughs> We've come across the mother load of compound here. This is great. And it's right next to oxygen. We're going to live, guys. We are going to survive. We are so close. We're so close to getting just one more piece of compound. That's all I need. It is all I need. There we go. Thank goodness. We've got next to no power as well. And we've got next to no... Oh, my God. <gasps> we've got next to no oxygen. We are so far away. We are fucked. We are going to die. We are absolutely going to suffocate. No, I don't want to suffocate. <gasps> no, monster. No, don't suffocate, please. Oh, God. What do I do? What do I do? <laughs> I'm just going to try and get him back as close as I possibly can, and then we'll just have to come and scavenge his body when we're dead. No, look at that dramatic death. <laughs> That's a very, very dramatic death right there. Where did you die? Where did you die, my little buddy? Oh, all the way over there. I'm a-coming. I'm a-coming. I'm gonna get my compounds, and then we're gonna build something super sexy. It's gonna be wonderful, and I'm not going to... Oh, there is a cave there. <gasps> oh, oh, we might have to go down. No, 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 not already. No, <laughs> no. <laughs> God damn, no. Oh, crap, we are going to die again. I'm gonna freaking... If I really... Am I really going to suffocate again? Oh my god, I am going to suffocate. Okay, we might need to run over to... <laughs> Shit. Shit. Oh my god. Oh god. Run. <laughs> quick, 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 quick. Go, go, get it, get the... Oh. Okay. All right. All right. This is good. This is good. This is good. It's not going to get us to a full tank, but it's better than nothing. That will be enough, I'm hoping, to get back there, and then fully recharge ourselves. Quick, give me all of your stuff, everything. I need all of it. <laughs> faster, 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 faster. Okay, all right. Maybe if I don't run back, then I won't use as much O2. Oh, for God's sake, we got to get through this. Oh, my good. Oh, my good God. Well, we're fucked. We are absolutely screwed. No, we're not. We're going to be all right. We are going to survive. Even if we get down into this trench, even if we die down here, we'll still be able to come back and scavenge my body for the second time. 
Why? Why? It's so close. It's so close. <laughs> it's right there. Don't do it. Don't die. Please don't die. You're so close. You're... Oh my god, we made it. He knew. He knew how close we were and he held on. You are a champ. Let's get this smelter created. Hallelujah. Okay, so now we can go away again. We will need a uh, power source for that, but I will. I'll try and do some farming in my own time and see if I can. Uh, if I can make something up for it, because we definitely need power. Obviously, if we want to uh, melt down some materials and get ourselves a vehicle, which we can then use to more effectively traverse this land or this area of the planet. But for now, guys, I'm afraid we're going to have to end it there. So I really hope you've enjoyed this first episode of Astroneer. I have absolutely loved it. So let me know what you thought of it in the comments below. And I'll have another one for you very, very soon. But for now, that is it. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.